Hi, it's Mark from Baylinks. Uh, today I'm going to speak you through the winter blowdown procedure. Uh, we're getting to that time of year where it's going to be very necessary. Uh, so first of all, if we look at our water tank, if it's going to get very cold, we're going to completely drain the water tank. Uh, that way we've got no danger of the whole thing freezing. Uh, if it's only going to go zero, minus one, minus two, we'd be good to leave the water in the tank, but we do need to turn the water supply off. So first of all, we'll turn off our main feed to the pump. And then secondly, we'll turn off this valve, which is the return from the water pump. Uh, with both of those turned off, we then direct our attention through to the pump. And here we've got a valve on the side that we're going to open up. And as we do that, water will start to drain out. Next, we come across to our air feed. Now, this is an air feed taken directly off the air bank. If we open the valve of this, this will then start to blow air into our water system. Uh, we're going to leave that for a couple of minutes. Uh, what you should see is you turn that on, rather than it just being a trickle out of the water pump, it's going to come to be actually blasting the water out. Uh, like I say, while we're on, we could use our hose, we can open the hose up, and that's going to expel any of the water that's in there to prevent the hose from freezing. Uh, finally, we're then going to come to the back end here, and we're going to press our flood button, which is then going to allow any of the water to come through our main water pipe and just dispense into the auger. At that stage, our blowdown is complete. Just don't forget in the morning that you've got to reverse all of the steps that we did. So we're going to close our pump off and then we're going to turn our water back on again. And finally, for the final part of the winterization, we turn to our admixtures. Now, obviously, if it's going to get very cold, we're going to drain our admixtures. So to do that, if we pull this pipe out and turn our tap, we can drain into any suitable container. Once our admixture is fully drained, we're then going to take the cap off the strainer to prevent any freezing going on and any potential damage to the strainer. So that's our strainer cap off. And then obviously in the morning, we've got to remember that we've got to put all this back on and refill our admixtures.